Hello world. Got some art right here. It's rather hot. So what name do you go by, sir? Thirteen. Tokyo thirteen. One three. Whatever you call it, it's me. That's what's up. So how long you been doing this? I've been drawing for forever and a day. Um, and I've been painting for I think about four years now. It's hot for four years. So, so did you go to school for this, or is this something that comes naturally, or? Um, I guess it comes naturally. I started off um, watching my brother draw, and I would copy the stuff he did and everything, and I kind of just went with it. So through like elementary school, I was like one of the three uh, folks who could draw real good and everything. And I just kind of kept going with it, going with it, and then, like I said, about four years ago, I picked up a brush and decided, let me try and paint something and see what I can do with it. So how long, so how many paintings have you done about, if you had to guess? Um, I guess about 50, maybe. You ever have a show in Selling? Um, yeah, I had um, I had a show last year actually, Superstitious Circus. It was in Baltimore at Miro Gallery, and um, I had some pieces along with uh, a few other artists. My homegirl, uh, Ronnie, that's a Jufro art. That's what she called herself. She ill, and her mother did some pieces and put in the show. Um, I've sold some pieces to some friends and folks who've heard about me. Through people, through people, through people. So is this the only way you do your art? Only on, on canvases and things like that? Uh, yeah, so far. Uh, I have done um, stuff on, uh, like, just painting on shoes. I mean, it ain't serious, like, um, sneaker culture or whatever. It's just a dude with paint to the brush or a pair of shoes, and I'm just painting on them or whatever. I paint on, um, this is wood, actually. Um, I love painting on canvas. I've painted on people um, and um, vinyl toys, like soft vinyl toys. They're called uh, money or dummies. I've customized those. That's what's up. So what inspired you to do such art? Um, I think it's, it's just more or less um, imagination, like images that I have in my head that I want to get out. And certain artists that I've seen, it just makes me want to grow more and more with my images and everything. Um, different stuff, like I worked in a tattoo shop, so I really like, um, like lately I've been really loving um, traditional style tattooing and everything, which is like um, just your traditional stuff, like uh, roses, um, Sailor Jerry pinup stuff, um, anchors, stuff like that. You know? But I mean, I'm pretty much just influenced by a lot of stuff. That's what's up. So you got any shows coming up soon or in the works or? Um, I told myself that I would focus more on painting this year and just building my collection because most of the stuff that I have now is already showing in shows. Um, at the Lamont Riggs Library, I have about six pieces there that I put up in February, and they're actually still on display. I have four pieces up Baltimore. Um, yeah, so I really need to build my arsenal up so I can have stuff to sell and to show. Okay, okay. Um, I am actually, me and my homegirl are trying to work on something that's on the hush right now, but I will say it has to deal with fashion and art. So, you know, they go hand in hand. On that. That's what's up. I know that you dress rather dark there. So how you, you, you are we doing, we doing a lot of colorful stuff. What's up with that? I don't know. That's, I think that's all just my style. Like, it's the whole, like, my style, I coined the phrase Nightmare Couture because it's a sense of, it's, it's, it's wild, it's out there, it's colorful, but at the same time, it has a dark overtone to it, which I think is myself. I mean, I wear a lot of black or a lot of dark clothing, but I'm a fun person. I like to laugh and 
you know, I'm a good time. I mean, I'm just a wild person or whatever. So it's that contradiction. That's what Nightmare Couture is about. It's about a contradiction. That's what's that. So I'm going to let you get back to it. Looking good so far. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you, Kelly.